proper night on the town. I know, it's like a proper day because it's Saturday night. With Jay and Trish. Ow. How are you doing? You know I'm here. Are you out here? I'm out here. Yeah, I'm excited for drinks. We're gonna go to Mercado, everybody, which is our famous spot that we love, that they talk about at Ride Doing the Podcast, and talks about how we go there, so. They do? Yeah, that's, that's, that's Jason and Trisha's favorite place. They were like, Shut up. They're like, well, we probably shouldn't say where. And they were like, well, there's a bunch of them, right? <laughs> is this the new podcast? No, this was one I listened to last week when we were at the hotel and I went and worked out, when I was working out. I didn't listen to the new one because you said that they were trashing me, so I decided yeah. not to listen to it. They did. Yeah, it's fine. Just blamed you for everything. Good. <laughs> Every story needs a villain. <laughs> You definitely were. <laughs> These glasses, I just love them. I know, that's why I wore them for you. Just like, really? you look like a Playboy radio host. So I was like, oh, this is going to be my glass I wear this every day now. It's sexy talk with Trish on Sirius XM. Yeah? It makes everything so much clearer. Even your face. Like, I can see really? your face so much clearer. Oh, it's like no. Crazy. That, now you're not going to think I'm so good looking. <laughs> I look at you. I'm like, <laughs> do I get catfish by my boyfriend tonight? Oh, my God. Like, it literally is so different, actually. Really? Because now it's kind of like all your features just blend together. As opposed to when I put these on. I think that's why even saying that I'm good looking over and over again in your vlog because you haven't been wearing your glasses. I, mean, I will say you do look different. Now you see my features. It's like when Brad Pitt went to HD. Yeah, they went to HD cameras and Brad Pitt had all these pock marks on his face. I think you just spit my mouth. I mean, I'm really blind. Like, I'm really, I really honeymoon's can't Honeymoon's over. We're not even on a honeymoon, babe. Another one of my Instagram friends got engaged. Who? Her name's Hay Parrish. She's a YouTuber. I say Instagram friends. She's not my friend. She's somebody on Instagram that I think is my friend. It's kind of like your friend. You see him every day. And the Ace family, their proposal video got 20 million views. How did he do it? He jumped out of a plane. What do you mean? They're like... You haven't seen it? It's like a big video. Okay. It's like 20 so, million. They're a so young couple. They're like younger. They're like 25. He jumps out of the plane and then he's got a microphone and he's like... Oh, no, no, no. no. Uh, she always wanted to jump out of a plane so he goes with her even though he's scared of heights. So he goes with her and when they land, the daughter, their da little baby daughter comes she up. She jumps out of the plane too? No. Oh, wow. And now because I watched that one, all the recommended videos are proposals. So I just watch the proposal all day. Oh my god. Is that what you really want? A YouTube proposal? <laughs> What if it was just a regular proposal or no YouTube? What if it was done in the privacy? Well, one, I think that's actually really sweet. But two, I mean, it wouldn't benefit either of us. True. It's we good. are a YouTube couple. It's a good point. I mean, I don't care. I just want to get married in Disneyland. <laughs> Is this like evidence? What the? Oh my god, I've been watching so much Crime Watch daily. <laughs> I have so many crazy stories of like couples who like kill each other and this is like back in the 90s and stuff was happening because it was like on Oprah. <laughs> You've been watching crime stuff and engagements all day. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's it's a good balance. I don't know. It's like love and then anger. Yeah, it kind of is kind of tame out for a Saturday night. I can't be tamed. Right. What? Nothing. Don't yell at me. What? Why would I yell at you? I heard you. They heard it too. Were you watching the tape? I didn't say anything. I wasn't even thinking anything about yelling at you. I don't think that's what the tape said. What are you, crazy? I think you heard things because I, I didn't I didn't say anything. Is this a proposal? Is this a proposal? <laughs> well, now that I hear you, you got to jump out of a airplane. <laughs> I feel like your proposal is like would not be good. I wonder what, I, I Well, I'm you, sure mine would be awful. How'd you propose the first time? I put the ring in the dog's mouth and I was like, oh, it's like, oh, he's got, he's got something in his mouth. <laughs> Ew. And she was like, get it out. Get it out of his mouth. He's going to choke. And I said, you get it out. And then she got it out of his mouth. Was it a box or was it a, a, just the ring? It was in a box. Ew. If a guy proposed me with a dog, I'd be like, no. Well, we love the dog. Where is that dog now? He's dead. Well, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> it has nothing to do with anything. Well, I think it does, because where's that marriage now? Dead. <laughs> I thought it was kind of a cute story to give it to a dog. I guess I have to. No, it's I guess cute. I gotta call the Air Force. Babe, I'm just being a hater. <laughs> That's actually really cute. I like it. Want me to have a flash mob? <laughs> yes. No, I can't tell you how to do it, but I mean, I think it'd be cute if it was like in yeah, a grilled maybe cheese. maybe you should. In a grilled cheese? Mm -hmm. and you know who I'd have in my wedding on my side? I'd have Gigi, I'd have Shane, I'd have Jeffree Star. Okay. That's not. Uh, who would you have a on highly your side? viewed video. <laughs> oh Who would you have on your side? No, I know about David. Oh my it's god. Gone. No, you wouldn't. What do you mean? You would have those people in your stand up for you on your wedding. Yeah, of course. 
you're joking. Why? What's wrong with those people? Nothing's wrong with them, but like, that's your close, like, who's gonna stand up for you? Yeah, I'm really close with those guys. <laughs> I've seen Scott a lot more than you've seen Shane. Oh, yeah, that's not true. Man. Over the years, I've definitely seen Shane more. We used to spend every single day together for four years straight, every day. How long have you and Scott seen each other every day? for? Every day for two years? Yeah, so I, you lied. I've seen Shane more. Oh, okay, so I should just dig up someone from my past that I don't see anymore and, and prop them up there? I talk to him. Just because you don't see someone doesn't mean they're not family. That's what he told me the other day. He's like, just because you don't see each other every day doesn't mean we're not family. I'm not, I'm not saying you guys aren't family, but I'm just saying, like, if I wanted to... You would think Scott's family. You would take a bullet for Scott. Shane literally told me the other day that he would take a bullet for me. Like, you're one of the few, few people I would, like, literally take a bullet for. I'd take a bullet for Scott. you take a bullet for anyone because you're a Uh, actually, that makes no sense what you're saying. <laughs> if I take a bullet for someone, I'm not a I'm actually really <laughs> brave. Aw. You're right. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I had a margarita. You had two. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm not drunk. I'm just a little buzzed, you know? Oh, we're going to change that. What'd you say? What'd you say? What happened? Why'd you look back? What'd she say? I think, I thought she said either Trish or bitch. I wasn't sure. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> One of the same, really. New couches. Can the new couch be filmed? Oh, shit. No, that's me. One minute. Hi, Matt. Jason, stand there and turn around. What's going you on? Turn around. Because of the couch? They turned around, Jason. I am turned around. Zane, you have to go. I'm putting on my shoes. Give me a break. What are you guys doing? We're going to the movie theater. For what? Uh, we're seeing Incredibles 2. Oh, I, I mean, we might see it because Zane's taking forever. Okay, hey. I'm Come edit on. I'm editing at my desk the other day. He gets on a phone call with Carly. He. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Get out of here! Get out of here! <laughs> <laughs> Come on. He's on the phone with Put Carly, and he just comes over and he's just talking on FaceTime to Carly, having a full-on conversation, watching me edit like really loud. Uh huh. And I'm like, Zing, walk away. He's like, what? I'm I'm not doing anything. I'm not talking to you. Let's be, let, let, let's be honest. honest. What you're editing wasn't even that good. <laughs> <laughs> Sam, take that out where his aim was funny. Don't use that part. Dolly, can you grab my camera? I got a brand new couch. I heard. Matt. I see. I see. I know Harry that because up. I can. Harry up. I oh, Big Nick left his car here. Oh, I see. All your young friends leave when I get here, huh? Okay, ready? Sit there. Don't look. Don't look. Don't look. I'm not. Hey, get the out of here. Okay, ready? Yeah. It's first of all, I love. I love how wide it is. Thank you. Okay, you can wow. sit. Okay, Jason, sit down. Interesting. Oh yeah, it's it's not good for old people. <laughs> Holy crap! Yeah. And they told you that, right? Yeah. They said old people aren't gonna like it. Yeah. Okay, all right. I I, I hear what you're saying. <laughs> first, first, I can't get up. <laughs> I can't get up. Man, we get the paintball gun. <laughs> Finally, a trap for Jason. I it's seriously I cannot get up. Actually? Yeah. Oh my god, you really do. Go back it. Now, if I didn't have to get up, there was a fire or something, I'd have to do this. <laughs> wow, it's crazy. Broke. I want 20 But bucks. I'm not broke. Follow me on Instagram. Oh, Four dollars right Thank there. You, Jason. You're good now, alright? Be good. Yeah. That's what I do, David. Trisha leaves money in my pockets and I give it to people. <laughs> For the greater what are you laughing at? Other people. She, the has interviewer asked the question and go, really yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> If you're watching like a soccer game. It's a good story. Kim Kardashian got this woman out of jail. Do you see your life going down another path? People have been asking me, are you getting into politics? And like, no, I'm still, <laughs> still doing me, but I enjoy this. this is, like, I'm still taking pictures part. of my ass. So, <laughs> I'm so primarily like, focused on so that. Fulfilled. Yeah, what's wrong? Mm, I'm 30 and I'm a loser. Mm. You're not a loser. Everybody loves you. I don't have a husband. I don't have a house. You live in an apartment. Apartment. You could buy yourself a house if you wanted. You make no. Money. I have, have bad money. credit. I'd have to put like everything. I put 100 percent down, and then I'd be broke. You don't have to buy a, a three million dollar house. You can buy a one million dollar house. Ew. Well, that's your problem. Well, babe, I don't want a one million dollar house. Okay, well, get a loan. Babe, can you buy me a six million dollar house? Babe, I can't. I don't have the money. You know I don't. How about a six million dollar house, and then you only have to spend a hundred thousand dollars on the ring. I just don't have that kind of cash right now.
Babe. Oh, fine, we're breaking up. Okay. I can't make you happy. I feel like I can't. You can if I just got married or had a baby. You want to get married? Uh, okay. I think we should go to counseling and then we can get married, okay? I don't think so. I don't think we need it. Why not? Ah! <laughs> Babe. You think everything's fine? Yeah. You know? I mean, I think we could work on some things. I think we just, we're both a little like, you know, a little off a little bit. And so I think that's it. You can't fix that in therapy. <laughs> I think you can. A chemical imbalance? <laughs> you think? Yeah, you've told me you're chemically off, and I'm chemically off a little, so. You think we're equally off? Yeah, because I know now, and we know each other when we get into those things. Like, I know when you, like, start to, like, snap. It's late at night now. I, I can recognize it, because you did it the other night. You just started, like, really getting heated and mad over, like, literally nothing again. And I was like, okay, it's, like, one of those things where it's, like, a long day for him. And, he, and I could sense it. That's why I was like, you know what? Let's just go to bed. And then I stopped arguing, because I knew it was, like, one of those night things of yours again, where you're just, like, getting mad over literally nothing. Um, it was something, like, I mentioned something about your dad, and then, like, you just, like, went off. And I was like, this is like something that's like not that's like chemically off in him right now. Oh, because you're well, you're reading over my, reading my over my shoulder. Yeah, that was so weird though. It was such a like a weird thing to go off on. It, but what my point of that is is you're recognizing I'm recognizing that you recognize where where I'm at when I'm starting to get a little fussy. We're like little giant babies when they get fussy. I just like let them fuss it out, you know. I just want to get married. I got married before, and it was like, you know, rough. Yeah, because you married a rough that I was, girl. I've been here this entire <laughs> second. <laughs> Just listening to all of it. <laughs> oh, hey, David. I forgot you were here. David caught me watching a gossip video about him the other day. <laughs> what was it? I was at my desk watching some, like, conspiracy David and Liza video. <laughs> and he came over and he was like, hey, Jason, can you watch this? I was like, I just I had to check it out, man. Make sure. Let's go confront Zane tonight. No, you guys. It's so weird. He's, he's, he's nice at the me. Incredibles. With who? With Matt King. Let's go confront him oh. about him. About you tickling his arm. That but I did catch Trisha the other day giving Zane. Oh my God. If we mentioned this in one more arm rub. rub. And David says it's not okay. That's David. the drama. That's she not. tickled Zane. <laughs> wow. What a great. <laughs> she touched Zane where? And this is me like grabbing his crotch. Get your own girlfriend, Zane. You guys want to go? David. Get out of here. Get out of real. Place. Real. 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 Tell me real, real. Real talk. How? This is. David. Look at this. Who is that? Is that Paul Rudd? Yeah. And that's my dad. Oh, wow. Oh. You do kind of look like Paul Rudd, actually. That. Wow. That's crazy. All right. Back to your box. David. <laughs> on a scale of um, like one to ten, like how scared slash like crazy did you think I was when I got in a fight with you on Thursday over Olive Garden? That was my first like fight freak out on you. Like I feel like I actually like flipped out because I was like, Dude. he didn't even, he wasn't even phased. You're like a kid. What like if you did that to me, I would be so upset and hurt. <laughs> he was just like, one thing about him, he's so zen. He, it didn't phase him for a second. Or he's just as crazy. And, and, oh, I get it. And not only that, and it wasn't like he was going to leave you either. He just will wait, wait, wait you out. He doesn't care. Because then I feel bad. Whenever I freak out on someone unnecessarily, I, then I felt bad. That's why when I got in the car, I was like, if you want to stop at your house, because I always feel bad after, but. Yeah, it's just like, it's just like, she's just in a mood. She'll get over it in like 20 minutes. That was crazy. I was so, I was like, ooh, I'm like too crazy. I didn't even think you were that insane. Really? Do I have to have a ring to propose? Can I have this? Yeah, obviously. For what? I'm running low, bro. <laughs> Baby, you can't, what are you going to propose with? I don't know. I don't want to spend $150,000 on a ring. <sighs> well, then. It's too much. Our love's not worth it, then. I can't. Baby, that's three months' salary. You don't know what my finances are like. You really need a $150,000 ring? You wouldn't be happy with, like, a $10,000 ring? <laughs> Wait, are you guys actually talking about getting married? Yeah. No, I just think, I just don't think, I just. I just heard you unzip. I thought it was your. I thought that so was the prank. So perverted. That's really funny. <laughs> Are you gonna have drinks? Yeah. I mean, up to you. I don't care. Should I? If you want. I mean, is it gonna be that kind of night? Like, are we gonna get lit, or is it just like? Can I smile for my selfie? Just kidding. It's a video. You guys are on my prank show. It's called David Dover Prank Show. I'll see you guys later. Bruh. Oh, I'm sorry. I know you don't like burps. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hey guys, real quick, smile for my picture. No, it's a video. I know it's a video. No, no, this one's, this one's a picture. Okay, if you say so. Just kidding. You're on my prank show again. God, uh, <laughs> damn it. I got to um, my alcohol in before we go to Boston. Smile, guys? No, absolutely not. We I already promise, did this. I promise the picture. Okay. Okay. I think he's going to say it's a video. No, no, All right, here we go. Say cheese. Cheese. It's a video. You oh. <laughs> didn't even hold the door for a beautiful lady. Oh. Yeah. No, babe, you don't have to. 
Babe, you don't have to. I love how you're like, you don't have to, and your camera just you desire. Do you're like, it's fine, you don't have to. No, I'm, sh I'm, I'm saving it so I'm going to show you that I don't need you to. Okay, that's good. I am going to grab it. Baby, you're good. Today. All right, that's good. Maybe there's no more in here. You did it. Are you all right? Why did you do that? Uh, babe, babe, we gotta get out of this YouTube game. Babe, I did it because David was in a hurry and I wanted to drink it. You think it's easy being Trisha Paytas? It's not. There's no she, rush. She's the one that chugged the beer. Yeah, because you put her in the rush. She's 30 years old. Dude. <laughs> I was hazed. You were. He hazed you. I peer pressured. Huh. He always oh. does it, huh? I do that to myself too. So. Me and you, sister, are in the same boat. I love you. David's so charming. Like, I always hate David. Like, last night I told you, I'm like, I'm never filming with David again. I hate his vlogs. I think they're trashy. <laughs> <laughs> and then today, I'm like, you're like, you want to film with David? I'm like, okay. Yeah, you did say that last night. And then when I asked you to film tonight, I was waiting for the text back. Like, no, I'm not doing it anymore. Like, why did you say that last night? Because I thought his vlogs got trashy, and I didn't want to be a part of them. What are you talking about? They've yeah, always dude, been you, trashy. You were pissed I, I brought the flamethrower. Huh? No, not that. I just think your vlogs have gotten a lot trashier lately, and I didn't want to be a part of it anymore. But I love what? It's just so funny. You don't want to be a part of something that's trashy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm classy. If, if, if anything, they got more Trisha friendly. <laughs> I, I'm classy. But I love David, so I like to be around him, but I just don't. What are you talking about? Babe, I told you when I met you. I You're like great the in the vlogs. I know I am. Babe, we should have sex on his couch or his bed. On the cloud? On the cloud, sex on the cloud. I did get a new couch. That would be amazing. That would be fun. Okay, wow, you never say stuff like no, that. No, I'm not gonna do that. I have children. How do you think they got made? I mean, it would be fun if, if David wasn't around. I just around thought about that, I want to puke. Oh, come on, you oh. know what? Trisha it's hates just... your kids because she knows they were conceived by sex. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, meanwhile, you know, I, I know, I know how you guys were made. <laughs> <laughs> You're not thinking that by anybody. You've had sex with so many people, and I don't yeah, get upset about. Yeah, but I didn't produce about... a baby. Bro, are you recording on your phone? <laughs> yeah, my foot, my camera died. Just Can we go call, to your house and just charge. Call quits for the night. No. Huh? Come on, ain't a vlog for tomorrow. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Can we go to your house and charge? Let's go show Trisha the cloud. What? Well, do we go to my apartment or the house? I want to masturbate. Trisha. That, that's my department. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, can we get uh, David's camera up here, please? Let's just do it for a little bit. All right. Right? Because if we go to the house too early, then we're like clocked out there. Why don't we go find Logan Paul? Mm. Right now. Sorry. Trisha, <laughs> this is why we can't get married. And you can title it tomorrow. Here's the title. I got it. Trying Me to, Trying to throw up challenge. So if we go to my house, <laughs> then we're just going to hang out there and someone's just going to end up passing out. Someone? Oh yeah, that one. <laughs> Are you You're already playing Twister. How's that beer? Pregnant. Why can't I get pregnant? I don't know. Why can't she get pregnant? I, I don't know. I mean, did you talk to the stork? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that was good actually. <laughs> I love that joke. <laughs> I don't get it. Simmer down, won't you love? I'm taking one for the team. We taking shots till it's love. You never know where we can end up. Need this bar, raise the bar for you. I hate a wardrobe in the winter. Don't you come up. Babe, don't go. Don't go. We're doing an outro. Goodbye, so I can everybody. Keep him here longer. Goodbye, everybody. Today's shout out is Casey. Casey Richardson. Thank you so much for watching. Why are you following my man on Twitter, Casey? Babe, did you change your name, old guy from the vlogs? Yeah, my Twitter name is now Old Guy from the Vlogs. What is with you changing your Twitter name every second? I, don't know, I think it's fun just to change the handle. No, it confuses people. Because I saw that, I'm like, that's not you. That's like a spam account. I thought that was like a fake account. Like someone like role playing as you or something. Like Old Guy from the Vlogs. Oh, really? Hey, come see us live um, July 21st at, at the Yo's Theater. Yeah, in Anaheim. It's going to be a tight show, guys. We have matching sequin outfits. And then also, uh, you can uh, check out the merch. This is uh, the View shirt. It should be available soon this think week. It's available. I'd love No, it is. It's, it, I think by, by Wednesday it'll be up on the well, Fanjoy site. Just go, this shirt is, this is the best piece of merch that I've ever been in. I like it. I said, can I have one? Can you give me the yellow one when you come and back? look at the back. Okay, don't show off that butt. It's my butt. Trisha has a new app also. <laughs> oh yeah, my and slot I'll machine app. I'll link it today in, uh, in the video, of course. She has a slot machine app, and if you know anything about Trisha, 
she loves to play slot machines. I love So it, it instantly made me laugh as soon as I saw it. It's actually really well designed and um, I didn't even know about it. She just like showed up last night. She's like, oh yeah, babe, my app came out today. I'm like, you're what? I've been working on it for seven months. I don't like to say things unless, because a lot of things fall through for me. Like that's my life. Like things just fall through for me all the time. Like right. I was supposed to be an Elvin and the Chipmunks movie and I shot like five scenes for it. The movie came out, wasn't in one scene. All right, well, anyways, go check out her app. Um, and we're pregnant. What's, 